I'm Michelle. Welcome back to Finally Revealed. In this video, I want to talk to you about something that should have occurred to me earlier, but it didn't until I saw a viewer comment. If you are really worried about going to jury duty, either because you got a notice now or just in general because you're realizing that you could be called at any time, do this. Go to court and watch a proceeding a trial or a hearing or whatever fits with your schedule. In your local location where you live, your city uh, has court for traffic, your county or parish or township has either a circuit or a district court which is in your county seat and they have criminal and civil jury trials all the time. They also have court tried matters. The jury trials are on a published docket, and by published I mean you can contact the clerk of the court, they're on a regular schedule because they, the whole jury process involves coordination with the voter records to get the pool, to get the notices out, to get the people there on a particular day. So when attorneys have their cases scheduled for trial, the judge has that calendar a year in advance. So you can go in now and contact the court as far as when are their jury trials scheduled. They will start on a Monday or Tuesday sometimes if it's after a holiday that's on a Monday. And you can find out what division it is. Some of this information is online. Otherwise you can call the clerk, find out when it is and just show up. Now I wouldn't go the first day, but you could go the first day when they're pooling the jury. Just don't get mixed up in the group. Um, I've never heard of any being involuntarily dragged into jury duty that way, but there will be a lot of people there and so there might not be a lot of room to um, move around. And please don't everybody go on the same day. that will get back to me and it will be, not be good. But go if you want to. You can watch the veneer, you can watch the opening statement, you can stay for the whole trial. Now in cases like the O.J. Simpson case or something where there's a lot of notoriety, there will be uh, reservations basically or passes given to people So because the courtrooms are not that huge. So, But that doesn't happen very often. So you can go whenever your schedule would allow, public except for juvenile cases or cases where they're closed. Maybe there's a confidential information or it's um, involving a guardianship or a mentally ill person or sometimes adoptions. They're closed. But other than that, for the regular criminal and civil docket, it's open to the public. In the old days, before there were law schools, uh, it, over in old Eng merry old England, that's how people got their legal education was by going to court and watching the proceedings and then that eventually evolved into our case reporting system so that we didn't have to do that anymore and we have books and electronic uh, records of what has happened but that's how they used to do it so if you are interested in what happens and you never got to go in school or you never had a, a case in you know it, where you were a participant or a witness go see what it's all about get a friend pick a day go watch a trial. Now I have had comments from people saying well, this isn't as exciting as TV and sometimes it's more interesting than TV because it's real. You know on TV while they do a really good job depicting trials and things like that they have a script and everyone has predetermined what they're going to say. That's not the way it works in a real trial. Things happen spur of the moment. People are surprised. People say things that were not expected and people lie and you'll kind of get a feel for exactly what happens. It should help you quell your nervousness and hey it may make you want to get on a jury next time. So anyway just an idea. Thank you for the suggestion and let me know if this helped you. Give me a thumbs up if it did. Share it with someone who might be worried about jury duty sometime in the near future and uh, subscribe. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.